Rachel, today is the day. In just a few hours, our lives are forever intertwined. I've never been more certain of a decision, even more certain than I was about the Honest Tea Co. being owned by Jessica Alba. <laughs> I pray that I can be, I can be a husband. <laughs> I might have to read this again. I can't read his writing. Um, <laughs> worthy of a bride like you. I love you more than this world can hold, and I feel like I am bigger than this world when I hold you. Let's do this thing called life together as one. I can't wait to see you walk down the aisle with your dad. I hope these are memories we'll cherish forever as the beginning of an adventurous journey together. You are my home and the luckiest man in the world to have you back. And that was really sweet. She says, Zach, what a sweet feeling that this day is finally here. Thank you for being my safe place, my hero, my best friend. Thank you for being someone I can dream with, feel completely myself with, and trust my heart with. I've prayed for you for so long. In this perfect timing, the Lord blessed me with you, and I couldn't have dreamt a more perfect partner for myself if I tried. You complete me in so many ways. You've shown me a love that I've always needed. I'm the luckiest girl to get to call you my husband, to get to love you and choose you every day forever. I can't wait to wake up next to you each morning, live in the sweet, simple moments, and build a beautiful life together. Thank you for loving me so well. You have my whole heart. You are sweetie baby. That's good. <laughs> Rachel, do you now leave your father and mother to establish your own home with Zach as his wife, to receive him as your husband, to make him a home where he will be loved and cared for as long as God grants him life? If so, who is giving this woman to be married to this man? <laughs> Rachel, today and every day to follow, I choose you. I choose to commit myself to you as your husband. I uh, promise to put God first, you second, and myself uh, last. I vow to be faithful to you. I vow to be faithful to Christ and lead our family accordingly. I promise to hear you and be attentive to you, even when the cheats are playing. I promise to remain steadfast and actively loving you, even in challenging times. I promise to take care of you, even when you don't need me to. I promise to be patient, even when you give me bad directions. I promise to actively support your dreams and build them into a vision for our family. Rachel, you are my home. I love you now and forever. Thank you for loving me so well. I couldn't be more certain of this decision to spend the rest of our lives together in marriage. I can't wait for our love to grow throughout the rest of our time on earth. Zach, I can't begin to put into words the joy I feel standing here with you. For the past few months I've been in disbelief that I get to promise myself to you, my best friend. You make me feel seen and known. Marrying you is the easiest decision I've ever made. Giving my heart to you is my greatest joy and gift in this life. I vow to love you wholeheartedly, to be fearlessly honest and vulnerable with you. I vow to be your strongest supporter and your biggest fan, your confidant and your friend always. I vow to encourage you to always pursue your dreams and to be true to yourself. I promise to do the same. Your desire to be husband and wife. You have shown your love and affection by joining hands, have made promises of faith and devotion each to the other, and sealed these promises by the giving and receiving of rings. I therefore, by the power vested in me before God, pronounce that you are husband and wife. May God bless you and keep you and give you ultimate peace. Zach, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
It is my privilege to announce for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Zachary Zarda.